I get home and look who's up. Say hello, good morning. Say good morning. Good morning, you guys, and welcome to this Christmas day 20 and 21. Hope you have been enjoying the video so far. In this video today, I will be introducing you guys to some of my simple recipes. Welcome back to the channel if you're a subscriber. If you're new, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Let's get into the videos, you guys. Last year, I to come in really quickly and introduce you to my vitamin T. This tea is a tea that I have been drinking um, ever since the pandemic started and I learned different things to keep our immune system build up. So this tea is what I use to keep my immune system up and it's also a great tea for when you for the when you have a cold or you're getting your throat getting scratchy and you got the sniffles. It's great for that. Um, now this is the footage that I lost on yesterday you guys where I took my time and prepared the tea and all that type of stuff. Well, you can prepare tea however you choose. It's your choice. But I do have the ingredients, so I'm going to insert the ingredients for you guys or share the ingredients with you guys. There is an, an ingredient missing, which is the ginger and green tea, but you can use any tea you prefer. Um, so I just wanted to share it with you guys in case someone may need it and want to try it. So let's get into those ingredients. We got vitamin E, vitamin C. We also have a daily multi vitamin. Little pinch of cayenne pepper, zinc, turmeric, positive energy tea, stress relief tea. We also gonna use a pinch of baking soda, orange juice, however much you choose, 100% honey, garlic powder, lemon juice, and apple cider vinegar. These are the ingredients that I use, you guys. Um, as far as the turmeric and the baking soda, be careful with that. Don't use too much baking soda because it will um, bubble over. So these are the ingredients. Make it a part of you choose. You can add water or you can make it without. I added water to mine. So anyway, y'all, drink it hot, especially if you're not feeling well, and it does boost the immune system. It's something that it could be done daily. I have fallen off of that, y'all, so I'm trying to get back into taking my vitamins, so I decided I would do it this way to go ahead and get them into my system. But it's very good, y'all. It's to each his own, whatever you want to do. Don't knock it till you try it. Hope you enjoyed the video. Be back with y'all later. Bye. All right, you guys, it's time to wind down and get in a little me time. So we're going to go ahead and take a nice bubble bath tonight. So we're going to use this Dr. Till's foaming bath with Epsom salt. It's a calm and serenity, which also includes rose essential oil and milk protein to keep the skin smooth. It comes out in a real milk, milky texture. So this is what we're going to use tonight. And it also has a nice smell. Then we're going to throw in this vitamin E oil, which is my favorite oil, y'all. This oil. Vitamin E oil also contains um, coconut oil. It has a really awesome smell as well. So let's get into our bath and relaxation time, y'all.
of course you cannot relax unless you have your nice relaxing beverage looks so good have a good night you guys see you tomorrow You know how Instagram, they have some things for free? Yeah. And when you click on download, a person will not have, need to know how to do all that. Because I don't know how to do none of that. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? So, that would be creative. And then they would have to work hand-in-hand -hand with a graphic designer. Because some things, like some banners, my ebooks, my 3D ebooks would have to be designed by the graphic designer. Um, some videos, like animation hey y'all hey it's this christmas day 21 and as you can see i've been in meetings and zoom class all day preparing for the new year just wanted to share this snack with y'all because i'm hungry y'all just a quick little snack um that i came up with years ago dorito chicken nachos something quick and simple let's get into the ingredients y'all we have ranch dressing chicken tenders Velveeta cheese, more cheese, sweet, spicy chili Doritos, and guacamole salsa. All right, y'all, so we're going to go ahead and chop these chicken tenders up right quick, and then we're going to throw those in the air fryer. Okay, you guys, now that we're cooking our tenders, I'm gonna go ahead and prepare everything else. Make sure that you wash off your dish before you use it. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and get our chips and we're just gonna place them on a plate. You can use whatever type of Doritos um, to your liking or your flavor or regular tortillas, um, whichever you choose. Then we're just gonna um, get a couple of slices of cheese. I like a lot of cheese, so I'm gonna use three slices. Hint right here, y'all, I didn't pop it in the microwave, but you can pop it in the microwave. Now we're gonna take our chicken. It's hot, so it'll kind of melt it a little bit. Just pour it over the top. Then we're just gonna put some of this guacamole salsa on it. Y'all, let me tell y'all about this salsa. The first time I seen it was on um, I Am Sharika B's channel. Sharika um, introduced this to me, y'all, and I tasted it. It is so good. It's green. But it's a salsa, so it's basically guacamole and salsa mixed together, and it tastes so good. So we're just gonna pour that over the top. It has like just a tad bit of spice, but it's not really spicy at all, but it has like a, good, a kick to it. Then we're just gonna place some shredded cheese over the top. And then we're just gonna pour some ranch dressing over it or sour cream, whichever one you prefer. I like sour cream, but I like ranch dressing too. Pour a little bit more of it. Just a little bit, you know what I'm saying. And that's it, that's the snack, y'all. Now, I did end up popping it in the microwave for about a minute just to melt the cheese a little bit more. So you can use melted cheese as you prefer, but like I said, it's a quick snack. So it's made to be made quickly. So I just popped it in the microwave for a few minutes, not too long because I didn't want my chips soft. So now, y'all, I'm gonna show y'all the drink that I made on last night. Just a little holiday cocktail for myself. Nothing to get me drunk because I don't drink <laughs> like that. But I have a casual drink or two every now and then. So those of y'all that's watching, they go on on here and call the pastor and tell them y'all see me make a drink. So we're going to use some ginger ale, Canada Dry Ginger Ale. Just going to go ahead and pour that in our glass. However much you want. Like I said, I'm not a heavy 
drinker, so most of this will be <laughs> ginger ale juice. And then we're gonna use some cran apple juice, y'all. That great value cran apple juice is the best. It got the best flavor. Ooh, y'all, it tastes so good. And then we're just gonna use a little pineapple vodka, just a little bit. And that's simply it. We're going to stir and drink. That's all to it, y'all. Simple recipes is what you're going to get from me. Something simple, something quick, but still tastes good. So anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't they look so good? Just a little from the quench your thirst. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Now let's eat. Have a good one, y'all. Bye. Thank mm -hmm. you.